guess what just happened? <laughs> it's, uh, it is seven o'clock in the morning on Saturday. Uh, just, just to give you an introduction. Do you see that behind me? That is our recycling plant right there. And that is our paint shop down lower there. That's our wash bay fueling station. And that up there, see all them trucks up there? That's a fueling station for natural gas. Uh, there's, I think, 18 trucks on each side of the wall. Then you come around, there's our scale house. And that's where we do our, that building in the back is where we do our, our uh, cardboard bailing, you know, more recycling. There's a scale. And if you keep going on off that road, there's a transfer station. And on Saturdays, this is what I'm doing right here. Document shredding. All your sensitive stuff, you know. I sit up here every Saturday for anybody who wants to come. Literally, anybody. Uh, I hang out here till lunchtime, pretty much. But I am sitting right here at the entrance. You know, they come in. They go on up, across the scale, and up to the transfer station. You see the guy in there working the cardboard right now? But a guy just pulled through. Just pulled through the entrance. He came up, getting ready to get on the scale, and I look on, on his trailer. He's like, got a pickup truck with a trailer to load of trash. I see a saw case. <laughs> and uh, I go hauling my butt over there, you know. And uh, I'm like, dude, are you getting rid of that saw case? And he's like, dude, if you want it, take it. I got it. So here it is. I'm going to flip this camera around. So there's our saw case. I have not opened it yet. There's something in it. And he said I could take it. What in the world is in there? I keep thinking about this, you know? What's in there? It is not big enough for a large saw, but there's something in there for certain. I keep thinking to myself, I wonder if there's a super easy in there or a super two. What do you think? What do you think might be in there? I don't know. But it's uh, it's like Christmas today, you know? I'm gonna open this sucker. We're gonna see what's in there. What do you think there is? Huh? I'm thinking Super 2 probably. You know what, let me move the phone. Let me get you a better view here of the opening. Set you on the ground. There's bird, bird poop on it. Let's take a look. You ready? There's a handle. Uh oh, it's a modern one. It, or I shouldn't say modern, but a more modern one. Look at it. Look at it. It's a 240. You know, of all the saws I have, I do not have a 240. Well, I guess I do now. Huh. <laughs> I got a 240. In a case. Oh, let me show you this. Here, let me... Let me set this up. So you can see better. I'm going to flip it around again. 240. Three eighths, low profile. Not much life taken out of that chain yet. Needs sharpened though. The anti uh, kickback stuff on there. Still has the safety tip. Those get removed almost all the time. I don't see anything wrong with this thing. Of course, it's been used, but I don't see anything wrong with it, not visibly. Cobwebs on it. It's just a little bent up up here. It looks like it might have been hitting in the saw case. I wonder if it'll start. Ah, 
There's fuel in it. Let's see if it'll start. Oh, wait, I got a customer. Hang on. I'll be back. That's out of the way. Let's see if this puppy will fire up. It'll be funny if it does. It's a good day. Just a little tuning, that's all it needs. He's probably getting rid of it because of that. There was some, some other stuff in this case, I wanna see. I swept this fender back around. All right, let's see if I can one hand this case open. Yes. There we go. What do we got in there? Got a handle covered in oil. Oh, got a file set. I don't think it's ever been out of there. The handle came out. And on a file and a little bit of wire bar loom, which is empty and all up inside the case. <sighs> that made my day. <laughs> I love getting solved for free, you know? All right, you guys have a good one. Thanks, later.